Austin Street and drove his pickup truck down that bike lane, striking pedestrians and people on bikes, uh, all the way to Chambers Street, where there are reports that he got out of the vehicle and began firing a weapon. Um, there are, again, reports of fatalities. Uh, I'm told there may be fatalities from this truck hitting people on bicycles. There may be fatalities from the shooting. Uh, there's still officers on the scene trying to sort this out. Uh, but again, officers telling me that the suspect is in custody and that the bomb squad is now checking out the vehicle to make sure that it's not booby trapped in some way with explosives. Uh, so they have located the suspect, located his vehicle, and are now tending to the injured and apparently perhaps wounded uh, along that path of carnage as it's being described. Yeah, it, it, it is being described by the New York Post, uh, which is owned by the parent company, or with which this company shares common ownership as a bloodbath in lower Manhattan. I, I, I will caution, because I feel like caution is the right thing to do, that we all in working in this building remember that immediately around the corner from here, and it wasn't that long ago, there was a vehicle which a took a turn into a pedestrian area of Midtown and literally appeared to be a terrorist mowing down tourists and a few locals. Uh, as it turned out, that person was a drunk driver going the wrong way on a one-way street, and as awful as that was, it was not an attack on this city or on anything else. Uh, this person, uh, we believe Rick's information is accurate, uh, again, developing stories, stories change. They change from police, they change from witnesses, largely, especially when the area is so big. If Rick's report, these are live pictures now, if Rick's reporting is correct and we have no reason to doubt it, uh, you make this turn there uh, and drive. I've been trying to describe this, this pathway for you. It's more like a small alley-sized bike path. It, it's as wide as a small street with lanes for bikes in both directions and room for runners on either side. It's a wide thing. It's protected.